I have my Jane's Agenda January Deluxe subscription box to open with you today. So let's get to it. Hi, welcome back to my channel where I share all things planner related, unboxings, plan with me's, flip throughs, and tips and tricks for you to use in your planner. All right, today I have Jane's Agenda Deluxe subscription box for January here. I'm so excited to open this up. I just love getting my subscription box every month and sharing everything with you guys. All right, this is a pretty box. This one's a little bit different than the ones I've gotten recently. And let's open it up here. It's a really pretty color. And it does say thank you on this inside here, like that. And then of course we have the James Agenda tissue. But it looks like a tour here, probably, because this is actually a pretty, like, hefty box in here. And I know I saw, like, sneak peeks, but honestly, I don't really remember exactly what we're getting in here. Um, but we do have to start off with this uh, card, January 2024. And we've got a letter here from Jane and her team, which I love that. And then on the other side, we have the uh, box tour card, January edition. And I love that. Okay, so I'm going to refer to that as I open everything up. Oh my gosh, what is this? So cute. Oh my gosh, look at this. We got an accessory pack. Oh, oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. It's like all coming back to me, like all of the sneak peeks. So I'm going to take everything out of here and go through it all with you individually. I'll be right back. All right, I am back. Now, if this is the first time you are stopping in, welcome. I'm Tina. And if you're returning, thanks so much for joining me in another video. Now, I am an affiliate of Jane's Agenda, and I do have my affiliate link down below. So if you do decide to purchase anything or sign up for the subscription box, I greatly appreciate if you use my affiliate link. All right, we're going to start off with the accessory pack here. Um, she does put all of the accessories like in one baggie, which I love that because course they want to save on plastic so I really appreciate that um let's open this up oh my gosh there's so many goodies in here okay I'm going to start off with this card this is a thank you on this side and then we've got um this beautiful picture here and it says conquer I love that I love the black and white Oh my gosh, so many good accessories here. Okay, we've got some cards here. It says it's on. I love that. Getting ready for the new year, which I love the new year. It's just like a reset. I feel like it's just a huge refresh. So love, love, love that. And I am so excited for 2024. I really love even numbers. So every time an even number year comes along, I just am so excited about it. I know I'm weird, but it is what it is. <laughs> you have to let me know if how you feel about like even numbers versus odd numbers. It's kind of funny because I was actually born in an odd number year. So you would think that I would like odd numbers better. But anyway, sorry, I digress. Let's keep going. We cannot become what we want by remaining where we are. This is so true. I love this. Love, love, love that. Perfect. All right, we've got a magnetic planner clip. I love these. Let's open this up. And this is in the allegedly gray color, which is a new color for them in their vegan leather line. Okay, so I'm going to take this actually out of here because... I want to see this. This is really pretty. Like, that's the thing. When you see things, even when I'm filming them or you see them when she shares them, you never really, like, appreciate it to its full until you actually, like, have it in your hands. It's really nice. I really like it. I really like that color. I don't know. I might have to get the cover. There's a cover that they brought out. It's a wrap cover that goes around your planner. I am thinking that I am going to want that. 
All right, we've got translucent sticky notes. Oh, I love translucent sticky notes. They are amazing to help like plan out. There's 50 of them here and I really like the square size. These are awesome. I love these. These are great to put in your like monthly view. Perfect, perfect. Oh my gosh, and then we have this mild liner here. I really like this color. It's so pretty. And we've got, of course, the bold side here, or the highlighted side, and then the fine here. And actually, let me grab this little paper and I could show you the color. I like this color. Very pretty color. Love it. I just sort of started diving into everything because I was just really excited. So I'm just going to keep taking things out of the box and just sharing them with you. Um, I do have the deluxe subscription box. She does offer three different subscriptions. So I'll explain that a little bit more at the end of everything here. So this, oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. It's a calculator. Ooh, this is fancy. I don't know why when she was showing it, I thought it was going to be smaller, but this is cool. I like this. This is actually a good size because, you know, my eyes, my eyes are getting a little old. So yeah, this is awesome. How fancy is that? I have not used like a regular calculator in a really long time. I know it sounds funny, but I always just use my phone. So having a, like just a designated calculator on my desk is going to be so nice. It does have the little feet here. So that's nice, like that feature. So that way when you put it on your desk, it's not going to like slide around all over the place. So I love that. All right, the next thing we're going to look at here is the decorative dashboard pack. So let's open this up. And I do get the half letter or Jane's Agenda junior size. That's what they call the half letter. All right, so we've got, ooh, these beautiful decorative dashboards. This is beautiful, this vellum, I love it. And it says here, a new era of me. Love, love, love that, perfect for the new year. And then under that, oh, this beautiful butterfly. I love butterflies. That is so pretty. And this one is double-sided with the same image on the other side, which is nice because then you can move it around wherever you want in your planner. And then I really like this one. It's kind of like this, it kind of reminds me of the sky like water and then you're like looking out and these are clouds. So that's what I see in this image. Very, very pretty. Love that. So this box is definitely focusing on tools for financial management. So we're gonna see a lot of that in the inserts here. So this one right here, we've got some card stock dashboards. And these are functional dashboard pack here. So we have affirmations of wealth. These powerful daily statements will guide you toward a more positive and abundant relationship with money. Love that. And then it's blank on this side. These are great because something like this can stay in your planner like all year long. There's a reading list, self-improvement for 2024. Each title is chosen to enrich, motivate, and empower your journey towards self-improvement. I love that. And then we have here financial wellness. This checklist is your ally in budgeting, saving, and cultivating a healthier financial future. Wow, there is so much information. These um, types of dashboards that she's been including, and in, I don't even know, it's probably been at least the last three subscription boxes. I really love them. There's like a wealth of information on here. And this is like takes a lot to put together. So this is just really, really nice and handy. And I absolutely love that. Okay, now I have three inserts here that I'm going to share with you. And this first one here 
is a bill tracker. Um, so it's got it, the heading on the top here, but it is designed as like a horizontal layout like this. So we've got a bill, auto pay, January, February, March, April, May, June. And then I'm assuming, yes, on this side, we've got the remainder of the year here. So this is pretty cool. I really like this. So this is amount paid. So you can go ahead and set up on here whatever bills that you pay every month along this column and then the smaller columns for each month you can write in what that bill was so this is a great way for you to go ahead and look at your spending like all in one so for example your electric bill and you could check whether it's an auto pay or not so that's good nice and convenient and then you can write in the amount for each month and it's really kind of a great way for you to like look at that and see what months you're spending more on electricity and you could sort of figure out well why are you spending more for this month versus last month that type of thing like what did I do this month versus what I did last month why did it increase so much. This is kind of nice to be able to see exactly why you're spending the amount that you're spending. So the same thing with like your credit card bill, that type of thing, you can write that in here. And well, why did I spend so much during this month? Well, because this is what was going on. So I really like that really great overview. Um, and let's keep looking here. Then we have recurring bills which the bills go down here, uh, the day due, and then the minimum payments. And then down here is total recurring expenses. So you could add that up. And let's see, there's actually eight pages because these are double-sided. Awesome, I love that. Okay, the next insert we have here is a debt tracker, and this one's for quarter one. So we're gonna turn this again horizontally here. So you've got your debt, you've got your interest rate, and then we've got the months for the first quarter, and then the total can go down here. And then on the back side, we have a notes section. So we have a page here for quarter two, quarter three, and then your fourth quarter. And then now the last insert we have in here is the January monthly budget. So we have an expected income section, the date and the amount. I really like this for myself, for my work. Um, and because I do receive incomes from various places um, because I do work for myself. So this is really helpful for me for like my um, business. And then you have total income expected. Um, expected bills can go here. Um, and then remainder to budget equals income minus bills, which of course makes sense. And then categories to budget. Okay, so here's the savings and then the different things that you need to budget and then expected amount remaining for the month. Okay, I like it. So that's the January and then we've got a note section on the back here so that way you could write in anything you need to. And let's see what we have here. Wow, okay, so we have a full year. That is so generous, I love that. Oh, I really like these inserts. These I think are really gonna work well for me. I like those. Oh my gosh, I'm starting to run out of room here and I have like still like so much more to share with you. All right, I love these. We've got some um, dividers here, top tab dividers, and they do already have headings on here for budgets, uh, expenses, and then debt. So you could see how um, you can grab those inserts that she gave us and they will fit in here. So she's already given us the tabs to fit everything into our planner to get us ready for 2024. I like these, these are frosted and that's really pretty. So these are nice because um, they are relatively clear and they look really nice over like any dashboard so i'm just going to grab these dashboards to kind of show you how that looks this is like two dashboards because i've got the vellum and then i've got the actual um illustrated dashboard here so 
you kind of get an idea of how that looks. And it looks a little bit more hazy because um, this is frosted. And then of course the vellum. So if I get rid of the vellum, then you can kind of get a better idea of how that looks if you just wanted to put like a dashboard behind there. Love that. Oh my gosh, awesome. All right, so when I first started unwrapping everything, I did mention that she does have three subscription boxes to choose from. So everything that I sh have shown you so far would be um, from the Planner Lifestyle box. So if you just chose to get that particular subscription, then you would get items um, that I have shown you here. Obviously, they change from month to month, and the subscription boxes are very seasonal. So anything that she does give you for the month, there's usually some theme that is involved with it beside the aesthetic of whatever season that you may be in. And she does go ahead and explain that and talk about that in the letter that she writes uh, to us in this card right here, which is on the back of the tour card. Now, the next three items I'm going to share with you are things that you would receive in the monthly cover club. So if you decided you just wanted that subscription, then you would get a cover, a dashboard set, and a page finder. So those three items, and they're great for just like if you want to spruce up your planner every month, you want a new look for it. That's a great option for you to go ahead and choose for the subscription. So let me go ahead and show you what we have here. And I'm gonna start off with the page finder. And here it is, it's so beautiful. I love butterflies. So this is so pretty and this is a clear, it's not uh, frosted or anything like that. I really like that. Now it does have a protective film on here. So if you get this, be sure that you take off the protective film. So I like to grab it from the corner here. And then I, I sort of like to grab it from this end. And you want to take it off kind of slowly by the punches, just because um, sometimes the plastic film kind of gets hung up a little bit on there. It's just the way that it is. Um, so if you take it off slowly, then you usually have a little bit better luck with all of it coming off. There you go. And not leaving all the little plastic pieces behind because that's annoying. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. And it says flourish. I love, love, love that. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. That crystal clear, oh, that's beautiful. That's just so pretty. Oh my goodness. The next thing is the cardboard dashboard set. It's so beautiful. Look at that beautiful peacock. I am just in love with that. It's so beautiful. I love the cream color. Um, I even love the accent of the green on the back, which in all honesty, green is really not my favorite thing, but that looks so, so beautiful. Gosh, okay, so we're gonna open it up here, and then we have this really beautiful abstract on the inside here. So this one is designed to have two different illustrations on here because this one is designed to layer underneath the cover, which I'm gonna show you in just a moment. But um, so we've got that like that, and then we've got the peacock on the other side of this one. So pretty. Okay, and I saved what I think is the best for last um, is this Gorgeous, gorgeous cover. I am in love with this cover. Oh my goodness, it is stunning. It has this beautiful gold foil on here. 2024, what the caterpillar calls the end, the rest of the world calls a butterfly. I love, love, love it. It is a clear cover, so therefore, we need to take off the protective coating. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that because it's gonna be like so pretty. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Okay, and now I'm doing exactly what I said not to do. <laughs> Let's take it off this way and take it off slowly so that way all these little bits don't get caught up in here. But oh my gosh, I love this. I know you're probably getting a lot of glare. I think I'll turn the light down so that way you can see it. 
without all of the glare. Oh, it's so hard to capture. Like I need lights. Um, I don't really have natural light here. Um, and you see it a little bit more clearly, but you definitely don't catch like the gold foil. So I'm gonna put the light back and then you definitely catch that beautiful foil. I love this, it's super clear. All right, and then we have, of course, the back cover and we have a quote back here. I hope that in this year to come, you make mistakes because if you are making mistakes, then you are making new things, trying new things, learning, living, pushing yourself, changing yourself, changing your world. You're doing things you've never done before. And more importantly, you're doing something. Oh, I love that. That just, wow. I got a little choked up there, I have to admit. That's beautiful. That is really beautiful. And wow, okay, I'm just like, ooh. You know, sometimes you read things and they just really speak to you and sometimes it's just things get to me and that one really like hit me. All right, let's take off this protective cover. Let me regain my composure. <laughs> Um, but yeah, oh, I am so excited about this cover. Oh, there's a little punch left here. <laughs> That's never happened. I don't know why I found that like very um, satisfying. Okay, so that's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, wow, that's beautiful. All right, now we're going to take some of these dashboards. <sighs> That's so pretty. That just takes my breath away. Love that. Love, love, love it. Oh my goodness. That is gorgeous. Wow. Okay. I am ogling and that's what I do. When I really love something, I just tend to ogle it and that's just the way that it is. Okay, and then we've got this option, which is beautiful as well, if you prefer the abstract. And then let's see how these others layer under here, because I know they're gonna be gorgeous. I'm gonna grab it with the vellum, and we'll do a, a little bit more layering. I'm gonna put the back cover to the side, so that way it doesn't interfere with all of the glare. I do apologize for that. Oh, that's pretty too. Ooh, ooh, I don't know. What am I gonna do? Oh my goodness. Okay, and then here is without the vellum. That's beautiful. I don't really like it with the vellum, I don't know. Okay, and then here is this one, and that's gotta really pop because you've got that beautiful like um, golden color behind it. That is so beautiful. And then of course the vellum, you can add like that triple layering in here if you want to, cause I really love that vellum. Love what it says, a new era of me. That's so pretty too. That really kind of like subdues um, anything because it's like a frosted look, of course. All right, here is everything that you would get if you chose to get the deluxe subscription box. Um, this box is so beautiful. <laughs> I feel like every single month they just knock it out of the park. Jane and her team are amazing. All of the beautiful items that they include, all of the incredible like functional inserts and these very informative and useful dashboard sets, and of course, all of the beautiful planner accessories. I mean, it's just such a stunning subscription box. And that's why I get the deluxe, because I wanna get everything. I, it, For myself, it's definitely worth it. It is a, just like a great treat that I get like every month and I really, really enjoy it. It's just a very elegant subscription and 
If you have not looked into it yet, I highly recommend that you do. Um, you know, if you want to like get your feet wet a little bit with it, and maybe just try the monthly cover club, you can get that. And those are the three pieces. You get the cover, you get the dashboard set to layer under the cover, and then you would get a page finder with it. And it's just a really great way for you to spruce up your planner every single month. Or if you, you know, don't really want to do that, but you like all of the other items, like all of the lifestyle items and the planner inserts, then of course the planner lifestyle box would be um, something that you might like better than just the monthly cover club. Or if you're like me and you want it all, then of course you would want to opt to get the deluxe subscription box. She does have other sizes available. I have really been enjoying using the um, junior size, which is the half letter size. It was something brand new for me for this year that I had decided that I wanted to switch and try that size out. And I feel like I've found my planner size and I really, really like it. So for right now, I am definitely staying with the junior size and I have the option to change if I want to because once you're a subscriber, you're sort of in and you can make any changes if you want to. If you want to skip a month, that's definitely an option as well. Um, anything that you purchase from Jane's Agenda, you do accrue points, which is awesome. So make sure if you are purchasing from Jane's Agenda, if you have purchased or if you are a subscriber already, please make sure that you check your reward points so you're, you're using those because they do reward you for your um you know customer loyalty and i i love that so just a couple of things i wanted to go over with you and if you are brand new to jane's agenda then welcome i hope that you enjoyed this unboxing you got a little bit of an idea of what her shop offers and go and check them out i am an affiliate i do have my link down below and i greatly appreciate it you do any shopping if you use my affiliate link thank you so much to all of you that have already used it i know many of you have used it and i truly am grateful for you so thank you so much for doing that it's something really small and it really helps me out a lot and it allows me to continue to do what i do here and share all of these beautiful items with you if you like this video please be sure to hit the thumbs up that really does help me out a lot here on youtube and i cannot wait to set up this planner for 2024 and be sure that you are subscribed hit the notification bell so that way you don't miss that video and drop a comment down below let me know what subscriptions you have do you only have like planner subscriptions or do you have subscriptions for like maybe makeup or anything like that i would love to hear all about it so drop that down below and if you watched all the way through to the end drop me a butterfly emoji thank you so much for joining me today and i will see you in the next one bye